judgment, heaven, or hell. That's it. And if you die with a, in a if you are not in a state of grace when you die, you go to hell. Period. No if, ands, or buts. But, so you but have the work to be of Jesus of Christ grace. upon the, the cross. The work of Jesus Christ is the beginning, not the end. It's all of it. It's the all beginning, sufficient. not the end. Jesus said it is finished. You're not listening. It's beginning, not the end. He opens up. He says, this is the end because he went up and he opened up the gates of heaven. That's all. You have the rules and the guidelines to get there. Whether you're willing to do it or not, that's on you. That's not on God. God doesn't send people to hell. We send ourselves to hell, period. If you don't Are you good want, enough to make it to heaven? Huh? Are you good enough to make it to heaven? I pray, but I don't know. And if you know the apostles, they were shaking in their boots, scared to death they weren't going to make it. And they were the apostles. So think about that for a minute. Where's that at? Peter and Paul said, he, through his, through his, he was fearful for their salvation. You telling me you've never read that? For, but I, I'm, I'm not understanding the reference you're, you're the, the, citing. Okay, so you know the entire Bible. No, I'm just saying I don't know okay. the reference. I've never heard there that is, before. Yes. Paul never says, I, letters, I doubt my conversion. Oh, no. He also speaks about the fear he has of not making it. He shakes with trembling. Oh, you're talking about yes. the, running the race and he wants to make... That's talking about his ministry, his, his, his being faithful no, to the end. he's talking about because what he did prior to his conversion. So he, he, he underwent all the suffering and for a salvation he know, didn't know he had. I'm trying to tell you that if you die without being in a state of grace, you go to hell, period. But the work of Jesus is sufficient. That's it what the reformers stood on. It is sufficient if you follow him and carry your cross and you are perfect like him and you are saint. No, yes. it's sufficient because no, it's sufficient. And it we're all saints. Sufficient. No, we Look are if, not We're saints. all fellow citizens. Oh, buddy, you are not. Oh, we are not. I'm we're a saint. Sure. I'm a saint because of the work of Jesus. Anyone who's in Christ is a saint. No, you're not. It takes a lifetime to get there, and a lot of us don't make it. And if you read it, understand very few make it to heaven. Few, not a lot. Jesus said few, because few, because no, many people who say they know no, Christ so believe. You think all you have to do is say this and you go to heaven. You're wrong. You have to do. There's a lot more to it. I was going to say, um, when Jesus says that in Matthew 7, that there are many on the road to destruction. <laughs> no, this is, no, you stop this right now. Stop, stop. We're trying to prove a point. Stop. No, I, I, no, I just... No, 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 no. You are going to have a conversation, have a conversation with Yes, me. can you let me talk? No, I just want to finish my... And you can talk all you want. I want to record this. I, I know, but you like to record stuff. You it's... stood out here like you were talking to people and nobody was listening to you. And you were talking like you were talking to people. And you've got this thing going on here where you're standing on a stool. So we were going about... Talking to people. We were talking about the... Talking, no, 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 no. We want to talk about something. Let's talk about your sermon. Oh, okay, good. Did you listen? No. I know you were shouting at nobody. Shouting at nobody? What do you mean? You were shouting at nobody. There was nobody there. There's people over you were, there. No. There, people there were the no people. Clinic. No. You were pretending like there were people. There's people at the abortion We stood here and watched you. We know. There's nobody in the parking lot? There was nobody in there. No, there's nobody in the parking So the people lot. coming in and out on the sermon. There was no people in there. There was only two cars, and they were inside. Oh. So, yeah. So who were you talking so, to? So but, but when you people came. You were saying, came, her, sir. You, no, there was nobody there. When people came in and out. You, who did you speak to? You people coming people. in and out. You saw people with your own eyes. Absolutely. You saw people. Yes, ma'am. You did? Absolutely. Really? What were they wearing? Two uh, there was There was a black man that came out in a car. It was like a Jeep. He's wearing a red shirt. Well, you saw him here, but did you? He was coming out. No, in the parking lot. And then that's talking. actually when I started to address young men, because I realized I'd addressed no, women in no, the sermon. No, no, no. There were no people there when you were addressing them. I watched you. Man, I, I know I know that there were people coming in and out. There were no people. In fact, a couple of times you, you, you talked with people. You can stand on the stool and you can't see over those bushes, so I wonder how you saw them. I said they come as in no, the driveway. No, 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 no. Right in here. You said they were standing in the parking lot. Were they in the parking lot? Because you didn't see anybody in the parking lot. They were on the video. That's a good part. That's a good part about filming things. I want to see I want to see the video with the people on them in the parking lot. But, Show but, me that but, part. Well, I don't have it right now on me. Like, I don't have my GoPro on me. No, but I But now, know. concerning, but I want to go no, back. No, no, I want to no, go back to where you're talking. Because you stood there and you told me you were talking to people in the parking lot, but there was nobody there. Absolutely, there were people there. Now, I want to go back oh, to what you were saying. Wait, wait, no. Theologically who, speaking. Who, who, who was in the parking I lot? I just said there was a black man wearing Just a red shirt black leaving. man and you did the whole So what if I, what if I preached an entire sermon? For, women, but women, what women were you talking to? Well, 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 there was actually, I think I saw two girls, one come so in and one come you out. You saw two girls. So if you didn't really see them, you think you saw two girls. No, in the, there, yeah, the, no, 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 I remember. I remember there was a white girl. I remember she came out in another car as well, coming out. Oh, in the cars you were talking to them because it looked like when you were standing up there doing this and you're saying, yes, you, and you were talking to people, there was nobody there. Mm. And there's people inside the building. You don't think God can bring people out to hear the gospel preached? 
I think plenty of things, but I think what you're perception was that you were making people think on your thing was that you were talking to people and there's nobody there. There were people there, people in the parking lot. And my friends people and I weren't were, in the parking lot. The one black guy was in the parking lot. True believers come out here and do this all the time. I know, preach the but gospel. what are you doing? You're, you're making, I know. But, you but I want to go back to theologically no, speaking. we're not going to talk theologically anymore. Because Why won't you let me say anything? I, every time I bring up a point, you interrupt me. Because you haven't made it. You haven't answered my questions. You want to go off on a tangent I've answered about your, I've no, answered no, your no, you have not. No, you haven't. Jesus said in Matthew no, 7, haven't. there are many on the road to destruction. You haven't. I asked. It seems like you're one of them. If you don't believe salvation is by grace, you're on the road to destruction because you believe that okay, you can contribute. Okay, we're done because, you know, you're spouting stuff. Stop. I want to talk, but you don't want to talk. You want to spout things. Turn that off. I care for you. I really do care for your soul. I really do. You know what? I care for my soul. What are you doing? <laughs> Excuse me. You're so funny. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe you. Please, I really, I really want you. You need to embrace Christ, truly. This is a picture of the Blessed Mother. Take a good long look, because she's... Mary would be so just... She would be abhorred that people are blaspheming her son, the we Lord Jesus Christ. Anything. I don't know what you're talking about. You're talking about, I have to take the mass to be converted or be at the enter into heaven. You have to do what? I said, no, you, you have said, to You said, unless you eat God the body... In a state of... You said, you said, if I don't eat the body, if, if I don't consume the body and the blood, yes, I won't be saved. It. If you don't eat his body and drink his blood, you have to I'd rather burn it at the stake, as my no fathers and great-grandfathers of the, the Reformation did, himself. So than, than take saying? the blasphemy of the Mass. That's not blasphemy. That's Christ saying that. It's blasphemy. No, it's not. It's it is. Much Christ saying now, that. I do want to have a conversation. I don't... Th Good. You can talk to the Blessed Mother. <laughs> Ma'am, please, act your age. I'm acting my age. We can. I, I would love to have. A, I really do want to have a conversation. Conversation with the blessed mother. You need to think about that. Oh, Rosary. Oh. The conversation with the blessed mother. And yes, he said, "Eat my." She's flesh dead. I'm not going to practice necromancy. Oh, she's very much alive, honey. She's the only one in heaven, the body, soul, and divinity. She's not divine. Yes, body, soul. She in Luke is. 1, when she said, God, my Savior, why did Mary need a Savior? Because she was a sinner, just well, like you and I. Wasn't. No, she wasn't. She so was why did she say, God, my Savior, in Luke 1? She said, my soul exalt, my soul rejoices in God, my Savior, in Luke 1, in her, yes. in the Magnificat. In God, yes, she did. In her Savior, why would she need a Savior? You're reading it the wrong way. That's your interpretation. How would you, again, how would you I told interpret you about interpreting. You're not the one that interprets. Only the church interprets. Who's so tell me what the there? church says about that. Mm -hmm. The mother of God. What is the what does it what does the church say about the phrase God my Savior? She is the mother of God. Saving grace. God my Savior. Saving grace. Glory. What does the church say about that? That's my question. Saving grace. He's the savior of the whole world. What are you talking about? Yeah, she needs a savior, precisely. He's the savior of the whole world. Without him, you cannot, he could not, oh, he had to open the gates of heaven. Do you understand He's that? a savior of the he people of God. He opened the gates of heaven. Do you understand that? He descended into jail. He goes into hell. Do you know why? He had to retrieve all those that were there. The Jews, Abraham, Moses, they were all there waiting for him. To Abraham open wasn't the gates there. Abraham heaven. was in paradise. No, they weren't. The thief on the cross was no, in paradise. No, they weren't. No, they weren't. David he was had in to paradise. Open the gates of heaven. He opened the gates of heaven. You do understand the gates were closed up until Christ came. No, nowhere does that insinuate it in yes, Scripture. Yes, it is. Nowhere. It absolutely is. That's why he came. In fact, it even says, the, in fact, it says in the book of Acts of that God did not abandon his, shoulder, his soul to Hades. He didn't say abandon him. He came and he opened the gates of heaven. That's what he said, I've finished. It's done. To he tell us that the, the wrath of, of God had been satisfied. You don't understand because you're interpreting it wrong. I told you there's only one authority. It's the Catholic Church. And pouring the salt Catholic on a driveway Church. doesn't do anything. No, the Catholic Church is the only authority. It's the true authority, baby. Salt on a driveway. They wrote the Catholic. They wrote the Bible. Do you not know that they are we the didn't, authors? The they Catholic know exactly Church. what they know. Babylon did not write the Bible. Did not write. The Church is not Babylon, and you better be careful. In Revelation, it, yep. No, nope, it isn't. Yep, your interpretation. It either, it either will. Again, your interpretation. We wrote the Bible for the love of Pete. We're the authority on The it. Jews the wrote the Old Testament, and then Jews wrote the... In fact, every writer of Scripture besides nope. Luke was a Jew. No, nope. no. Nope. None the of them Catholic even knew Bible what the Catholic was Church was. Yes, they did. None of them had any no, idea what the Pope was. The monks wrote it on paper, parchments. They were Catholic. It was the church. You're talking about the Latin Vulgate. I'm talking I'm about the original you. Greek and that Hebrew. That is the Bible, my dear. Every word of it. We wrote it. We compiled it. We put it together. And you people are trying to 
turn part, they're taking books out of it, which is a sacrilege. The Apocrypha is uninspired because the Jews Absolutely. didn't consider it inspired. Wrong. And we, we are the authority. There's only one authority on the It's on scripture, sola scriptura. The authors know the authority. They know what they meant. When Do you agree with any of the five solas? Oh my gosh! Yes, I know about what? Do you agree with any of the five solas? Sola gratia, sola, sola fide. No, you are making. See, you don't. Those are Latin. <laughs> Those are Latin phrases. Doesn't matter. It's a Latin phrase. You can take a Latin phrase about the devil. Does that make it okay? No. And sola was inserted. Luther put that in. That's a sacrilege to change the words of the Bible. He didn't. He, yes, he Luther did. never he insinuated that. Did. He surely did. He it. Yes, he did. Where? He added it in. It was never in there. What? Solo whatever. Solo scriptura? Yeah, never he never added, added that into the Bible. I can assure you. You need to go back and study your history so you missed And Luther didn't oh, write Luther didn't translate the scripture in Latin. It was already translated into Latin. He translated oh, it into German. Fides is an insertion. Sola and it was not there. Fide. Yep, it wasn't there. So when Paul says in Romans 3.28, for we maintain that a man is justified by faith apart from the works of the law. No, no, you the scripture has the power. The word of God has the inherent power. You like to twist them. And you know who else likes to twist stuff and make it not true? Satan does. So be careful. So what would the RCC, what would... words and you twist them, you're doing Satan's work. Stop it. What would what would Babylon say about that text? You hard about that. You need to think about what you're doing. God's words. His Bible is a Is Pope the vicar of Christ? Is Pope the vicar of Christ? When Paul says in a few... Peter is that Peter has passed it down from the beginning. You don't understand the apostolic chain. Succession, yeah, yeah. the creed says. And if you say the creed and you don't believe the words you're saying, then what good is your religion? Hey, can I just real can I real quick ask you another... I want, I want you to believe the gospel. No, uh, you want me to buy into your crap. It's not going to happen. It's scripture says. It's not what scripture says. You take and you twist scripture. Shame on you. And you pull books out. Shame on you. That is God's word. The, the Jews didn't affirm it. For you to twist it is wrong. The, blaf- the blasphemous you. RCC did shame that. They you. added them in shame there. Shame on you. Stop it. You throw scripture trying to prove your point. It's not your point. It's God's point. It's his church, his authority, and he is the only authority. It is the Holy Spirit, and it's already been interpreted, and you need to put twist in the word of God. Period. Stop it. The scriptures are the sole infallible rule of faith for the church. To suit your own self. Stop it. It's not okay. That's what the Bible plainly says. No, it's not esoteric. The Bible doesn't say to twist it and suit yourself. It says salvation is by grace, so that God gets all the glory. It's ultimately about the glory of God. Are we going to give glory to the Pope and Mary and priests or God? God is jealous for his own glory. And you need to back off. And I won't have you blaspheming against the Lord Jesus Christ. <laughs> it's our fault. I don't. But you do. And you need to be careful what you say. I really do. I plead with you to repent and believe the gospel. Truly. I know that I know what it says. The gospel is a gospel of grace. Paul says in the Acts 20:24 20, that the, the gospel is the gospel church, of grace. The one true church. The one with the authority, not some split off Protestant, every other corner you can pick up whatever you want to do and make it okay because you can throw this little bit of scripture at it, that little bit of scripture at it. Shame on you. Don't do that. You did. Go read the whole thing in its entirety. I've read the entire Bible. I have, I've studied Catholicism. You Don't have you think I know? Absolutely. That's a, oh, you're Absolutely. lying. Absolutely. I've you studied Catholicism. I have, I have oh, certainly studied you Catholicism. Saved, right? Because you can break the laws of God and still go No, to you're supporting it. licentiousness. Oh, the Bible never, never, never advocates no, 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 no. for licentiousness. Until you study Catholicism, you have no right to say I've that. studied it. I've you studied Catholicism. Studied. You have not studied it. I have. No Listen to debates. Know. There's no way you've studied Absolutely. Absolutely. You've studied from who? Who did you study Catholicism from? Who did you go? As a thought? I've read official church documents like I just read to you. Well, how do you think I found out about that? No, no, no. Canon you 9 of the Church me. of the Council of Trent. show me where you got the catechism to study. That's what you need to study. And you show me where there's any blasphemy in the catechism, and I'll convert to your faith there, young man, because they are the authority, and it is the Word of God. Scriptures are the Word of God. Scriptures are the Word of God. Scriptures are authoritative. Christ, my dear, straight from the Word of Christ, who is God, in the flesh. 
flesh. You need to study the catechism before you can open your mouth about anything. Not the, not the Catholic Church. I, I believe in catechisms, but a Protestant catechism. <laughs> Benjamin Keach's catechism. You can make up anything. Any Tom, Dick, and Harry can start his own church and say, this is what we believe, and that's what you're doing. Shame on you. Shame. We derive any authority from Scripture. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. I really do, Hail really Mary, do desire that you would Lord repent and believe upon the Lord Christ. I trying to do God's work. But you need to study Catholicism wholly, and then you take a good long look at it and you figure it out. I'm, I'm, I'm ashamed when Protestants try to capitulate to Rome and try to identify themselves with the Roman Catholic Church because it's blasphemous. Yeah, and, and Paul killed people for following Christ. He, Paul killed people? Yeah. When? Before he converted on the road to... Oh, 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 I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, that makes it okay. Okay, he did that before. No. No, no. That's what no, I'm I was just I just didn't I didn't Paul understand what you were saying. Paul committed major sins before he converted to the Holy Catholic Church. Hello. So you need He converted to, to Christ. Oh my gosh, you need to go and get a Catholic Catholicism catechism and study it. You did recording her? Yes. Catholic? Yes, ma'am, because she tried to she she was grabbing my phone, she was really No no no, I tried to get you not to record. She was, you have continued to do that's that. That's not nice. That's not nice. That's not even fair. It's not even practical. Well, she was. No, she no, was, no. She, she, she. You've been recording the entire time. I found she's out. Girl, you're a guy. I haven't, I haven't laid a hand on her. I haven't done anything. No, you're recording me, and that's not okay. What? I asked you not to. But, you, you know what I it. noticed today? You still did it. First of all, the pastor at our church was a Baptist and is now a Catholic. He confirmed. So I think Both that times. maybe, Both. I think that maybe it would help you to go and speak to them because. They can run circles around your talk, and they can explain things to you, and it would be very beneficial. I mean, you're young. Yeah. They're a little bit older than you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but again, if you stand upon the authority of Scripture, it doesn't matter your age or where you studied. It's, the Scriptures it themselves are sufficient to stand. And maybe you studied what twisted. 16 years. You you can't. Can't. You know, so. you yeah, and that's all. That's all I wanted to discuss was simply because no, we were didn't. she was no, we were didn't. talking about different you doctrines, dogmas that. of the church, and I was okay. even talking about pro no, Protestant one doctrines. Thing that and I think is wrong with what you're doing is is showing up with a camera and and putting it on the women who are going into here. That's an invasion of privacy. The other thing I noticed you doing not necessarily when, if I if I went in their home and filmed them. That certainly would be the other thing I permission. noticed is your 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 motions that you were doing when you were recording this and there was nobody was there. And yeah, there was nobody there. So you're going there, there to take this there. back. No, you're going there. to take this back to your church and you're going to tell them that you were outside of the abortion clinic preaching to thousands and you weren't preaching to anybody. So that's what I don't like about it. I think it's kind of fake. Ma'am, um, the car's going back and forth as I was preaching. Who, who Was no one driving not, those cars? No, there was nobody there when you were doing it. There was watched, nobody there and there was this big gesticulation. But but no. but if you just watch the if you watch the recording, it's because I was passionate because this is this is important. People's well, souls are important and babies being well, slaughtered. That's why we're step, praying. Yes, but it's you're not taking about something us. and you're putting it's it about out there trying to him undermine. and it's about praying for them. It's not standing it's not up on the soapbox and telling them that they're horrible. I mean, I just, did you listen to my sermon? Yes, I did. The entirety of my sermon. Yes, I did listen to it. And I really think it's kind of it's for yourself so that you can take it back to your church and you can play it for them, which you told me you were going to do. Yeah, because you asked me, you said, why do you record these? And I said, because I have believers who are edified by listening to the preaching of the gospel. And and um, also, it's interesting. But nobody's because, listening to you. It's also they interesting because... They whip in there, they whip out of there, and you're standing on the uh, well, I just want to say this. The, the other reason I record is situations like this in case I, I get falsely accused or, or things become more contentious like this. To be able this is, not to speak um, to especially me being a guy and with women, and it was I can easily get... I'm not saying that you would do that, but I don't know you, and I don't, I don't know who I'm going to encounter on the street. So this is very we good for my own protection. not to do it because it runs them in there. You weren't helping people. You didn't get one person to roll down the window. I did. I approached them. But Again, they we didn't do it because they heard you preaching. Because they yelled by you because you were loud with your speaker on and you were preaching. People aren't coming here to hear preaching. They're coming here to get a service to done murder. That we yeah. don't want them to do. Precisely. And we're trying to get them to stop. Think. We can get a. We can get you help and get them to redirect. Instead, you're spouting scripture at them and you're running them in there. 
Because they don't want to stop. They're not going to run in there. Oh, they did. Not one. God will bless the preaching of His word. Not one. Absolutely. Turn around, my friend. Again, we can't base our we can't base our methodology based off of we we can't base our methodology off of pragmatism. We sure can because I'm out here a lot. We have to be biblical. And we get a lot of them to turn around. We have to be biblical. No, we we don't have to. Not until we get to to a point when they're ready to hear it. Well, I gotta get I do have to get going because this is just back and forth. This is just it's it's circular. But please go and look up Father Christopher Smith at Prince of Peace on Russia. Is that the name of church, the church? Uh, Prince, of Prince of Peace, Peace. is the church. It's a Catholic church. You know, Baptists don't really like Catholics. But he was a Baptist. His father is still a Baptist. Huh? His father is not a Baptist. He converted? He converted? I didn't know Another miracle. That. And his mom died Catholic. Yeah. I didn't know that. His mother converted. Yeah, yeah. You have to understand. You've got a little bit of a nugget of what God wants you to have. Well, I, I will no, say I have studied Catholicism, and I'm going to study it further in the future. Why don't you just you, talk you, you are you would be so listen to me. You got this nugget, but God wants you to have the whole gamut, and you're not going to get that unless you start looking at God's church. And I'm not telling you anything other than to go and study. You want to know? You want to know God totally? Get a Catholic catechism and study and quit go to saying, scripture. Quit, Just go to scripture. Quit, quit putting up this roadblock and listen to Listen to what I'm telling you. I, You're not I know. I, I'm just backing up. You, I just, personally. I just need to separate physically. Put the damn gun. Put the telephone down. I'm talking to you. Ma'am, put it down. Ma'am. You're going way high. I've got to back. I've got to record this. Put it down and talk to me. What is it with you? You have to have this. For my own protection, absolutely. Protection from what? I don't know if you'll falsely accuse me. You already falsely accused me of preaching to nobody when certainly I was. All right, I do need to get going. I really do. I need to get going. I need. I do need to go. Seriously. Repent and I need you to. You need to repent and believe the gospel. Or you'll be lost. Salvation is by grace, so God gets all the glory, all the honor. Oh.